Assalamualaikum and good day everyone. I am going to share about problem identification of our product entitled Motorcycle Trailer for Wheelchair User. The first technique are by direct observation to the user. Wheelchair user always compromise by inaccessible public transport. Besides, they also need to depend on other people to get on and off the bus. Lastly, they thought they have fewer opportunity to access public transport due to the barriers of mobility that range from lack of wheelchair ramp and uneven pathways. Well, act and regulation for disabled people has been made, so we have to take appropriate measure to ease the difficulties that they need to face so that they can live independently and take part in all aspects of life. Some related studies had found the initiative that can be taken as well as the statistic of population using classified types of vehicle in their rural area, design consideration, and also the requirements needed by the wheelchair user to use the vehicle. For this product, two patterns is taken and can be referred as shown in the slide. The inventor reviews the drawing, text of patent, and also patent applications. The first wheelchair user named Yana complains about how the taxi driver treats her and refuses to take her as their passenger. Nani said that the bus provided is not wheelchair user friendly where they don't provide accessible transportation for disabled students. Apart from that, a very fortunate disabled people named Master Roy fabricated kit his own caddy or side trailer. He said that it is considerably easier and quicker. Besides, Tomia also said that it is an outstanding job creating this kind of transportation because bikers like Tommy would love to ride again after a long time, not be able to. Lastly, Lestari from Indonesia said that having modified motorcycle gives her more freedom because she can't go to work by public transport. From here, we can see that having modified motorcycle to have a side trailer really plays an important role and giving a big impact to wheelchair user. The last technique is using 5W1H analysis. So what is the product? The product is named as a motorcycle trailer for wheelchair user. Why we want to create this product? Because we want to help transport disabled people when there is no car or ambulance available at the moment. Who will be using this product? Wheelchair user with companion that has a motorcycle will use this product. Where the problem usually occur? Well, anywhere, but our focus is on the rural area. When can the product be used? It can be used when disabled people would like to go out by using motorcycle or when ambulance takes time to arrive. And lastly, how the product works. The wheelchair has a total access onto a trailer with a door ramp where the trailer is attached at the side of the motorcycle along with harness straps for safety. For the next explanation will be about the Google Form survey. We distribute a survey to the disabled people through the Johor Baharu Disability Support Association. According to the result of the survey, feedback has been extremely good. In this session, I will go over the survey data that we received. The majority of respondents to the survey are men as opposed to women. Respondents who answered also indicate that they live in the urban with the rural area coming in a second followed by the suburbs. The majority of those who respond are wheelchair users or have family members who are. Although the majority of our respondents own a car, some do not. Even so, we discovered that respondents experience issues when they wish to go out or take a walk based on the result of the survey. Usually, they will overcome these issues by asking for aid from others. Looking at the following question, the majority of respondents claimed that this motorcycle trailer will help them with their daily routine. They also believe that this trailer will benefit to the people who use it since they believe it will make it easier for them to be independent. To some extent, they can contribute to all of their routines and do not need to seek assistance from others. The following questions are about the feature that respondents believe should be accessible for this project. This trailer must also be simple to use so that it can pass any obstacle that may be faced. We have highlighted specific features to be used in our project depending on the response.
The first is comfort, which is followed by safety, then easy to use, aesthetic, making it easier to put a wheelchair in the trailer, and finally, a guarantee. Last but not least, here are some suggestions for improvements to our project. Next, I will pass to the next presenter. Thank you. And I will continue with the compilation of design requirements for this product. Uh, I have outlined eight uh, parts of design requirements, which are materials, physical performance, user requirements, environmental requirements, identity, uh, function, and as well as for the aesthetics. Uh, so first of all, for the materials, this product is made is made from uh, main made materials which are galvanized steel, steel rod, rubber tire and polycarbonate windshield. Uh, and uh, for the physical part, uh, the color is silver for the wheel uh, for the trailer and then uh, sh the shape is a compact rectangular fit and for the flexibility, it is able to be rolled by uh, the wheelchair person of course. And next, for the performance, the task is the trailer can accomplish the action of boarding the wheelchair with the person. And for the function, it is able to give maximum safety towards the rider. Okay. Uh, next, for the user requirements, uh, first, safety. It is equipped with harness and door lock. And for the comfortness, uh, it is equipped also with raw windshield to protect from the sun and rain as well as uh, the shock absorber uh, and then for the practical uh, it is an automated moving platform uh, or mechanism to lift the wheelchair person then place him on the trailer and of course the easiness of use uh, next for the environmental requirements we have efficient and recycling for the efficient uh, by achieving a maximum productivity with minimum wasted effort or expense and for the recycling, the materials are sustainable. Okay, for the identity, the name of this product is a uh, motorcycle trailer for wheelchair. And then the style of uh, this uh, motorcycle trailer for wheelchair is a side trailer with windshield. Okay, so uh, the function of uh, this wheelchair, this trailer with, for wheelchair person is uh, the purpose is this assistive transportation uh, will be able to transport those people by using motorcycle and last but not least the aesthetics uh, the form or the extra function is that we have a reverse gear for the platform to put down the wheelchair person and right now we move on to benchmarking for benchmarking we are comparing our products with an existing product in the market so as you can see in the picture this bike have a sidecar uh, for wheelchair person so this product features a uh, bike specific uh, for most model sidecar mounting hardware and also a manual ram for wheelchair access a brand bodies brake system and turn signal and brake lights for safety reasons and last one swing arm suspension with Hagen shock for a premium ride so this cost of this product is around $10,000 that are equipped with a uh, manual ramp and brand body brakes for add-on for power ramp is around uh, $850 Density of target users For our product, we are targeting cert a certain group of users which are as follows First, uh, people who have and ride a motorcycle which have a companion using wheelchair and vice versa uh, Second one, we are focusing people in the rural area because mostly the transportation over there is a motorcycle and also may apply to urban people too and last one uh, the person is aged around 15 and above uh, who have a license to ride a motorcycle next wow factors of our product our product have four wow factors which are safety comfortness practical and convenience for safety, we are providing strap to make sure the wheelchair doesn't move around in the trailer. For the second one, comfortness, we are providing windshield and absorber. Windshield is to prevent air from hitting the person in the trailer. And then the absorber is for smoothing the ride of the trailer. 
for practical we are designing the trailer in a compact size to make sure it can fit in the small uh, road in the rural area for convenience we have a door that acts as a ramp for the wheelchair can be pushed into the trailer and last one holder which can helps the wheelchair person to enter the trailer lastly estimated costing for our product we are listing the parts and components as you can see in the table for the first one is trailer uh, which consists of ramp and body uh, the expected price is around 800 ringgit for the materials for the second one absorber around 60 ringgit tire and rim around 200 ringgit straps around 80 ringgit windshield around 100 ringgit and last one label around 250 ringgit and the total expected price for our product is around 1400 ringgit uh, comparing with uh, benchmarking, uh, our product is much much lower price because uh, in Malaysia the material cost is much lower uh, from the US.